An old friend of the Minnesota Fighting Vikings is back on the market as New York Giants surprisingly released edge rusher Afadi Odenabo. Jordan Renan, go. Uh, defensive lineman Afadi Odenabo is being released per source. Guaranteed $1 million this offseason. Was just never a fit with Giants. Had 10.5 sacks previous two years combined in Minnesota. That's a very Gettleman thing. Hey, sign a player that's not going to fit what you want to do. Guarantee him money and then... Nah. And he was never a good fit in New York because they had him playing stand-up outside linebacker, which, no. Like, Afadi, this man is a hand-in-the-dirt 4-3 defensive end. That's how he butters his bread. So, yes, yes, they, they misused him. He still got a million bucks out of it, and he can sign with another team. So the question is, should the Vikings run it back with Afadi and bring him back former Vikings defensive ends like Weatherly and Everson so hot right now? Baby. Uh, background. Afadi was a 2017 seventh round pick out of Northwestern. Worked his way up from the practice squad. Had a cup of coffee with the Cardinals and the Browns on, on his journey. And then was a rotational pass rusher in 2019 where he notched seven sacks playing inside and outside. Was a starter by default through injury in 2020. His 42 pressures led the Vikings and his three and a half sacks was also most on the team among players not named Yannick and Gakwe. Remember that? It was fun times. And I know the fans are mad at Afadi. Oh, he had a chance to be edge rusher one last year and it was fool's goal. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, and yes, Afadi struggled on a bad defense. But his best season was 2019 with Daniil, with Everson taking heat off of him in a rotation. Seven sacks is, is pretty hard to get in the National Football League. But that's okay. There's nothing wrong with being a supporting third option. George Harrison was one of the best artists of all time. And he was third banana on the Beatles behind Paul and Ringo. Woo! Roster wise I would obviously take Afadi over Jalen Holmes, but I think once uh, Everson comes back, Holmes will be cut. Uh, then it comes down to Afadi or Weatherly. Now, Weatherly has a $2 million contract, but only has 500 k guaranteed. That deal only becomes fully guaranteed once he's on the roster to start week one. And I think Afadi's a better pass rusher from the edge, but I think Weatherly is better inside and better uh, setting the edge against the run. And given the makeup of the roster, the Vikings may value what Weatherly brings to the table uh, more at this point. So I don't know if Afadi would be down for a Vikings reunion. I think that he will have other options out there. Teams like the Jets, that he wouldn't have to move, signed with the Jets or the Jaguars or the Colts, among others, uh, could also use some help on the edge. And I would be down for it if both sides are ready to get after it again. Bring it on back, that love and feeling. Why not? Why not? Like we said, bring him back all the edge rushers. Let's bring back Jared Allen. Let's bring back uh, Jim Marshall as well. Let's go, man. Go ahead. Uh, but your thoughts. Should the Vikings reunite with the Fadio Denaba? Reunited? And it feels so good. Let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Most support that work below. Some in the Venmo. But until next time, Skull, production value.